Hello everyone. I welcome you all in today's session of prefixes and suffixes. I'm Kavita Sabrawal, working as English mistress at Gurman Senior Secondary School for Boys, Raho, SBS Nagar. Students, please keep your notebooks and pencils handy so that you can note down the important points and new words. Now, let's start with our today's lesson. Read the following sentences carefully and see the underlined words. First, I like mangoes. I dislike bananas. The underlined words are like, dislike. Second, it is possible to save the patient's life. It is impossible to bring the dead back to life. The underlined words are possible, impossible. Third, his father is a literate man. Many people in our country are illiterate. The underlined words are literate, illiterate. Let us examine the following pairs of words closely. Students, these pairs of words are the same words which were underlined in the previous sentences. The first pair of words is like, dislike. If we break the word dislike, it would be D-I-S dis plus like. The second pair of words is possible, impossible. If we break the word impossible, it would be I am im plus possible. The third pair of words is literate, illiterate. If we break the word illiterate, it would be I L L plus literate. Students, we can see that the second word in each pair of words is made up by adding a group of letters like dis, im and ill before the first word. Dear students, now let us read the following sentences carefully and see the underlined words. First, I teach English. I am a teacher. The underlined words are teach, teacher. Second, he is happy. Happiness lies in good deeds. The underlined words are happy, happiness. Third, rose is known for its beauty. Rose is a beautiful flower. The underlined words are beauty, beautiful. Students, let us examine the following pairs of words closely. And these pairs of words are the same words which were underlined in the previous sentences. The first pair of words is teach, teacher. And students, if we break the word teacher, it would be teach plus E-R-R. -R. The second pair of words is happy, happiness. If we break the word happiness, it would be happy plus N-E-S-S, -S, ness. Students, the third pair of words is beauty, beautiful. If we break the word beautiful, it would be beauty plus F-U-L, full. 
we can see that the second word in each pair of words is made up by adding a group of letters like ar, ness and full after the first word. Students, isn't it interesting? It's just like a vocabulary brain game. Now here we have some more words. The following words can be broken as below. The first word is replay. It can be broken as R E re plus play. The second word is misunderstand. The word misunderstand can be broken as M I S miss plus understand. The third word is tiredness. It can be broken as tired plus ness. The fourth word is enjoyment. This word can be broken as enjoy plus meant. The fifth word is unemployment, which can be broken into three parts. Un plus employ plus meant. The sixth word is disqualified, which can also be broken into three parts. Dis plus qualify plus ed id. Students, similarly, the word uncooked can be broken as un plus cook plus id. We have added un before the word cook and ed after the word cook. So students, here un is a prefix to the word cook and ed is a suffix. Prefixes are groups of letters that come at the beginning of the words and make new words. For example, R E RE is a prefix to the word play and makes a new word replay. Suffixes are groups of letters that come to the end of the words and make new words. For example, ness is a suffix to the word tired and makes a new word tiredness. Students, please keep in your mind that prefix is always placed at the beginning and suffix always comes at the end of a base word and a new word is formed. Now look at the following words and see how we can break them. Students, please write these words in your notebooks and try to break them. The first word is frozen, second return, third extremely, fourth disappointed, Fifth, shivering. Sixth, wisest. Seventh, relies. Eighth, looking. Students, please write the spellings very carefully. I know you can do it. Just think and write. It's an easy exercise. Students, I hope you have done. Here we have the answers. You can check and tally your answers. The first word is frozen. We can break it into froze plus un. Students, froze is the main word and en is the suffix added to it. It is a suffix because it has been added after the main word froze. The second word is return. 
we can break it into re plus turn. Students, turn is the main word and re is the prefix added to it. It is a prefix because it comes before the root word turn. The third word is extremely. We can break it into extreme plus li. Here extreme is the main word and ly is the suffix added to it. It has been added after the main word. The fourth word is disappointed. We can break it into three parts. Dis plus a point plus ed id. The root word is a point. Dis is the prefix and ed is the suffix. The fifth word is shivering. We can break the word shivering into shiver plus ing. Shiver is the main word and ing ing is the suffix. The next word is wisest. We can break it into wise plus est. Wise is the root word and est is the suffix. The seventh word is realize and we can break it as real plus i z e. Real is the main word and i z e is the suffix. The last word is looking. Students we can break it as look plus ing ing. The main word is look and ing is the suffix. Students now let's learn prefixes with their meanings and examples. I have made a table for you with the headings prefix, meaning, example. In the first column I have written some prefixes. In the second column I have given their meanings and in the third column I have given examples of the given prefixes. To start with the given prefixes are non, un, im, in, il, ir meaning not opposite. Example nonsense, unhappy. The next prefix is re, r e meaning again back example revisit replay the next prefix is m i s miss meaning wrongly not example misunderstand the next prefix is d e d meaning reverse remove out of example deactivate dehydrate the next prefix is co co meaning with together example coexist the next prefixes are dis dis di die meaning separation away apart to example dislike does it students i have got one exercise for you please try to solve it fill in the blanks with suitable words by adding prefixes to the words given in the brackets first he lost the match, so he was, dash, the given word is, happy. Second, 
My teacher asked me to dash the paragraph. The given word is write. Third, he is very dash towards his duty. The given word is responsible. Fourth, the innocent man was punished for no reason. This is dash. The given word is justice. Fifth, the patient complained of dash at night. The given word is comfort. Sixth, the key is lost. We cannot dash this door. The given word is lock. Seventh, the thief dash on seeing the policeman. The given word is appeared. Eighth, the postman was very rude and dash. The given word is polite. Ninth, Driving without license is dash. The given word is legal. Tenth, I'm sorry as I dash you. The given word is judged. So please write the answers. You have to fill in the blanks with suitable words by adding prefixes to the words given in the brackets. You can do it students. It's an interesting exercise. Now let us check the answers. First, he lost the match so he was unhappy. The prefix un has been attached before the word happy. Second, my teacher asked me to rewrite the paragraph. Here the prefix re has been added to the word write. Third, he is very irresponsible towards his duty. The prefix ir has been added to the word responsible. Fourth, the innocent man was punished for no reason. This is injustice. The prefix in has been added before the main word justice. Fifth, the patient complained of discomfort at night. The prefix dis has been added. Sixth, the key is lost. We cannot unlock this door. The prefix un has been added before the word lock. Seventh, the thief disappeared on seeing the policeman. The prefix dis has been added. Eighth, the postman was very rude and impolite. The prefix that has been added to the word polite is I am im. Ninth, driving without license is illegal. Here I L ill is the prefix added before the word legal. The last sentence is I'm sorry as I misjudged you. The prefix Miss has been added to the word judged. So students, now let us move forward. A suffix is a letter or a group of letters added to the end of a word. So students, now let's learn suffixes with their meanings and examples. I have made a table for you with the headings, suffix, meaning, example. In the first column, I have written some suffixes. In the second column, I have given their meanings. And in the third column, I have given some examples 
of the given suffixes. To start with, the given suffixes are e r r o r r, meaning one who or showing a comparison. Example, teacher, faster. Next suffixes are able, able, meaning capable of being. Example, unforgettable, reversible. Next suffixes are d, ed, meaning forming the past tense or having the quality of. Example. Added, loved. The next suffix is ing, ink, meaning forming a gerund meaning an act of or the present participle. Example, singing. The next suffix is meant, meaning the act, state. or result of an action example appointment government the next suffix is i v e meaning having the quality of example creative divisive students i have got one exercise for you Please try to solve it. Complete the following sentences by adding suitable suffixes to the words given in the brackets. First, Virat Kohli is a brilliant dash. The given word is play. Second, God is the dash of the universe. The given word is create. third ram is very intelligent and dash boy the given word is act fourth dash is a good exercise the given word is swim fifth the movie was full of fun and dash the given word is enjoy sixth he felt dash after losing the game the given word is disappoint seventh the lion is the dash of all the animals the given word is strong eighth this news is not dash the given word is believe so please do it students please write the answers add suitable suffixes and complete the given sentences please write the spellings very carefully students i hope you have done now let us check the answers first virat kohli is a brilliant player the suffix er has been added to the given word play second god is the creator of the universe the suffix or has been added after the word create third ram is very intelligent and active boy the main word is act and suffix i v e has been added fourth swimming is a good exercise the main word is swim and the suffix is ing fifth the movie was full of fun and enjoyment the suffix meant has been added to the word enjoy sixth he felt disappointed after losing the game the suffix is ed 
Seventh, the lion is the strongest of all the animals. The suffix est, est has been added to the root word strong. Eighth, this news is not believable. The given word is believe and we have added the suffix able. Students, let's do one more exercise. Choose the correct prefix or suffix to fill the gap. Students, please write the correct option only. No need to write all the given options. So let's start. First, in many countries, it is dash legal to keep a gun in the house. The options are UN, I L I N. Second, there was some dash agreement over the proposal. The options are D E M I S D I S. Third, Sonia fell dash conscious in the kitchen. The options are U N I N I R. Let's move to the next slide. Fourth, you have little aware dash of the problems you will face. The options are meant, ness, able. Fifth, he could not hide his disappoint dash for his low grades. The options are N-E-S-S I-V-E M-E-N-T Sixth, his father is a detect dash. The options are I-V-E I-N-G E-D The students, I hope you have done. It's an easy exercise. Let us check our answers. First, in many countries, it is illegal to keep a gun in the house the correct answer is i l second there was some disagreement over the proposal the correct option is d i s third sonia fell dash conscious in the kitchen the correct answer is u n Sonia fell unconscious in the kitchen. Fourth, you have little awareness of the problems you will face. The correct option is N-E-S-S, Ness. -S. Fifth, he could not hide his disappointment for his low grades. The correct option is M-E-N-T. Sixth, his father is a detective. The correct option is I-V-E. It's an interesting exercise, students. The next exercise is also very interesting. Try to solve it. Form a new word by adding a prefix and a suffix to each of the given words. The words are pardon, courage, respect, repair, act, believe, manage, conscious. So please do it. And students, please keep in mind that you have to add prefix as well as suffix to each word. I know you can do it. Just think and write. I know it's very easy for you. You are really doing good. Let's move to the answers. So, students, we have the answers here. First, pardon. By adding a prefix and a suffix, the new word formed is 
unpardonable second courage encouragement respect disrespectful repair irreparable act inactive believe unbelievable manage mismanagement conscious unconsciousness so students please check and tally your answers you have really done very good today and now dear students it's time to wind up today we have learnt prefixes and suffixes which are a part of english vocabulary we have also done a few exercises for more practice take the help of newspaper book magazine or dictionary find the new words break them into prefixes main words and suffixes keep in mind practice makes a man perfect thank you goodbye